Face Clan to me is family. I've known these guys for seven years now. They were my dream team to join and the fact that I'm a part of FaZe and now I have one of the most subscribed YouTube channels in FaZe is crazy. I would never ever be where I am today without those four letters in front of my name. What's up guys, FaZe Rug here. What's going on guys, FaZe Rug here. Yo, what's going on guys, FaZe Rug here and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video. So what would you guys do if you saw your phone attached to like 10 balloons and then you just see it fly away? What would you guys do? I know I would freak out. I'm gonna try to make up some sort of joke, like say, hey, I can make your phone disappear. Like, give me your phone. And I'm gonna say, wait here, wait here, like don't look. I'm gonna attach one of these fake phones to the balloons and then I'm gonna be like, yo, watch your phone disappear and I'm just gonna like release it in the air and they're gonna watch their phone fly into space. All right, let's go get the balloons. I hope you guys enjoy. Smash that like button if you're excited. Watch the pool, watch the pool. So we got a paintball gun. So when I release their phone and it's like super high, I'm gonna shoot it down with a paintball and hopefully just get the phone down because we don't like littering. Don't litter. All right, let's get it. So now we're gonna go pick up the balloons from Party City. Then we're gonna go to our first victim. All right, should we, should we head out? Let's go. Yeah. All right, are we gonna take the Armada? Yeah. Let's go, baby. All right, I might need shoes for this adventure. <laughs> Yo, check out the car we're taking today. It's the FaZe Clan Nissan Armada. Look at this. Red Tiger from MW2, baby. All the gaming fans out there, we got the FaZe logo. And then look at my shirt, matches right here. Be honest though, was this your favorite camo? I did like Red Tiger, but I liked Blue Tiger. I never liked Fall. But like. Between blue and red? Red. Yeah, red yeah, I just love red. Phase, phase red, come on. Exactly. All right. Ooh. I've never driven the Armada before. Oh, yeah. This is dope. The only difference about me on camera and off camera is the energy. Like, on camera, you want to be like super like, yo, what's up guys? How's everyone doing? Like, obviously if I meet fans in public, I'm just like, yo, what's good? Like, how are you? Like, so that's honestly the only difference. In high school, I was very antisocial. I just wouldn't talk to anyone. I was the quiet kid in class. I, I had maybe three or four friends and being in the position I am now, I have to like talk on the phone a lot, meetings and meeting new people. So I feel like being on camera helped. And honestly, with the help of my fans as well, like. They always like motivated me and boosted me like, oh, Rogue, you look good. Like that helps. Like just a little compliment like that. I'm like, dude, someone thinks I look good. Okay, cool. <laughs> dude, look at this. I don't know how this is gonna fit, but we got them tied to the phone already. Ooh, automatic. All right, this is, this is gonna be tough. Noah, you wanna help? Uh, yeah, I got you. Okay, so I don't know if the, pin do you think this is gonna fit? I think so. Okay. So, yeah, we got a few oh big ones. Oh no way, God. no way, let's go, baby. All right, we gotta do this quick, let's go. Oh my God. So when I made my first like five digit check, that's when I was like, okay, this could be serious. And since then I've just been grinding every single day. Maybe like the most days off I've ever had was like three. The past seven years of my life has just been a camera and editing and just everything about making content, but it's what I love to do and I just don't plan on stopping anytime soon. I joined FaZe November 26, 2012. I won't forget the date. It's actually my phone password. Like. I don't care if anyone knows that. I was literally screaming and crying and my family, everyone's like, why are you freaking out? Who cares? I'm like, no, I just, I just joined FaZe Clan. I, like, this is crazy, I joined FaZe. I remember when he was accepted in FaZe Clan, when he screamed, I go, what? Did he get accepted in Harvard College or something? Where's FaZe? Me and Ron laugh, like, okay. Is yeah, that he, a he's, big deal? He said, Dad, what? you don't know. Dad, you don't understand. <laughs> we I didn't said, yeah, know. Yeah, Dad, that's something big. I said, okay, well, good for you. And since then, like, that's where my name actually got out there. Like, I always say it, like, I wouldn't have 13 million subs without Face Clan. I wouldn't, I don't know where I would be without Face Clan, to be honest. Give me a hug, you're my cousin. Okay, we don't, okay, we don't dab hug. each other up in this family. Okay, okay, a hug, my bad. Okay, bad. Junior, so you've agreed to let me do this magic trick on you, right? Yeah. Basically, I'm just gonna make your phone disappear. Okay. I'm yeah, good with the magic yeah. tricks. You already know. 
So, um, can I have your phone? <laughs> God, my family is just traumatized from all the pranks that I've done. No, no, no like, you're good. I could, I'm actually gonna make it disappear. So, these are the words you don't want to hear coming out of my mouth, but I want you to sit here like this and close your eyes. That's the worst thing you could hear from me, by the way. <laughs> like, keep them closed the whole time. Excuse I swear to God, if I love a little bell I promise you're not gonna lose your phone. He has no idea that we're just gonna launch his phone in the air. Okay, we need the paintball gun too. I think you're good. All right, Junior, open your eyes. Just wait. You're fine. I'm gonna make it disappear. You're not gonna let the balloons go, right? No. You're not gonna let the balloons go, right? I'm not. I'm just letting you know, like, this is how I do magic now, you know? No, no, okay. Let's go. Ryan! Junior! Oh! Junior, your phone! Wait, wait, I got it! Oh my god, my head! Like it's obviously gonna come down. You're gonna get it back. We just have to go way. find it. We you just know, I have to find my phone. Oh, fi you have to find my phone on, right? I don't know, bro. Okay, yeah, the high five, dude. dude. It's not coming down, bro. That's gonna go up for like a thousand more feet. Is this your phone? <laughs> <laughs> Junior! Yeah! Junior! Yeah! Bro, you thought I was really gonna do that with your don't phone? Do gimme, gimme. Don't no. do that. That's not funny. Bro, That's not I'm funny sorry. Question. I love you, bro. Your phone is good. Okay, it's better than actually. This is why my, my this is why my family loves when I call them and say, hey, like, you want to come, like, do a quick yeah. video, you know? <laughs> hey, thank you, brother. Thank you. When I first joined FaZe, I made gaming videos for about a year or two more. And then I realized, like, I had a pretty interesting life outside the gaming room. And I want to show my fans what else I could do besides game. Like, I want to introduce them to my family. And I figured, like, why not give it a shot? So I started, like, doing more pranks and I started vlogging. And I think that's just how my channel started blowing up even more. Hey, what the? It's windy. This is serious. I want to give you this check for hundred thousand dollars. Hundred thousand dollars for me. For you. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think he's honest. He's, um, you know, he has a good, good heart. heart. Very oh, good heart. On time. and <laughs> off the camera. This kid, like, I would wake up. He have a surprise for me. He doesn't have to put in a video. He bought me a car. He bought. Not only those things, he's just a good person in general. Everybody love him. Yeah, I mean, we're happy, you know, to see him doing this, you know, like my boy is doing this to be helping people. You know, I, I'm so, so proud, you know. The last person to drop their phone wins $10,000. How are you guys feeling? Yeah, I'm gonna pass out. No, seriously, I'm, I'm literally gonna pass out. You might have to call 911. I'm good. Oh, bro, I'm about to break. Oh my, that's such a high distance, though. Hey! Wait, she's at, wait, she's, wait, 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 Anthony just won $10,000 and he got to keep his phone. I got two brand new phones right here and we're gonna go surprise my brother and Kaylin because they dropped their phones and they have no idea. What? Wait, what? I got you. Do you guys really think I was gonna let you lose your phone and me Holy not? Come on. Brian. You already know I had to come and clutch. And the thing about them, all this fame and money and everything, they did not change a bit. They're the same humble little kids with good heart. Whatever they do, they do the same and more behind the scene. It's not only in camera. So this is my backyard where a lot of the magic happens in my YouTube videos. And this pool right here has a ton of stories. I've put alligators in here, giant ball pythons and anacondas in here. I've played Fortnite in here. I've just done so much to this pool, but it's clean now. We clean it every week, so. The snake did poop in there, though. <laughs> it's just a super insane view. Like, you can't come out here and, like, not be happy, you know? You need, like, a nice, relaxing state of mind before making a YouTube video, or at least for me, and this is, like, perfect for it. There's so much that comes out of being a big YouTuber, and I'll always just be thankful for it. I'll never take it for granted. I'll never be, like, Oh yeah, I deserve to be here. I, yeah, this is this is where I am. Like, no, no, no. I'll never be above anyone, and I never put myself above anyone at all. Do you ever have these moments where like you get affected by the way people think of you, or like the comments online? I'm gonna be honest. Some comments, again, like do get to me, but at the same time, I always have to try to remember you can't please everyone in the world. 
you could change the world in a positive way and like have a crazy impact on life and you'll still have those people talking down on you. My persona, FaZe Rug, Brian Awadis, myself is more about positivity and inspiring young people to do big things and a lot of people can say I do it for the camera and that's fine, like I don't care because I just know, like it, it comes from my heart and I, I just know that I just do it to inspire young people to like do good in this world, you know? I'll never ever think that I'm like better than FaZe or like, like I never see it as like, oh I'm the biggest FaZe member, like, like I, I just I just don't see it like that. It's just just such a cool thing to be a part of. Like to this day, millions of people want to join FaZe and the fact that I'm one of the selected people to be in FaZe is just a blessing itself. And I'll just never take it for granted. I could never ever see myself not being a part of FaZe. I can never see myself being rug. It's always just FaZe rug and I feel like it's gonna be like that for the rest of my life.